Good afternoon, Captain James Polk here, the Marion County Sheriff's Office with your daily crime report and a new cowbell, thanks to Valerie. Look, at, it says more cowbell. So, anyway, an unsecured barn. Let's see, located 12,000 block of West 326 was entered and someone stole assorted electric tools and other items. Estimated loss there was $1,100. Then someone entered a home in the 1700 block of Northeast 169th Court. That's Magnolia Haven. They stole property valued at $500. Detective LeVay arrested William McGeer uh, after he stole checks from his work at Grandview Landscaping Services, forged them in order to cash them for himself. He was transported to our Gold Star Hotel. Did he really think he was going to get away with that? Someone broke into seven storage units at the neighborhood storage located on Southwest, I'm sorry, Southeast Highway 484. One of the units had a loss of $1,200 worth of copper with the remaining six claiming no loss other than the cut padlocks. Investigation revealed that on October 21st, Michael Adino uh, got upset with an eight-year-old child for saying a curse word, at which time Michael backhanded the victim in the face, causing bruising and swelling. He admitted to striking the victim and was placed under arrest, transported to the Gold Star Hotel. A home in the 2400 block of Northeast 32nd Place was broken into and electronics were stolen, valued at $3,100. Ryan Frost left the CVS store located on Southeast 109th Avenue in Summerfield with $100 worth of unpaid merchandise. Ryan was followed to the McDonald's by a witness where he entered the bathroom stall. Deputy Rendall entered the restroom and announced his presence and observed Ryan dispose of a container which, after being retrieved, was found to contain a drug pipe and cocaine. Once placed under arrest, Ryan was found to be in possession of 10 pills, later identified as meth, along with marijuana. Uh, he was transported to the Gold Star Hotel. That's all for your Throw em Back Thursday. Please like us, share us, download our app, and we will see you tomorrow on TGIF. Thanks for watching.